This is what the war in Vietnam is all about. The old and the very young. The Marines have burned this old couple's cottage because fire was coming from here. And now when you walk into the village, you see no young people at all. Fire was coming from automatic, light automatic weapons fire was coming from all of these villages. It's not really one village, it's a string of huts. And the people that are, are left, come this way, Khan. The people that are left are like this woman here, the very old. Been in action like this before, Marie? No, I haven't. Not like this, I haven't. Did you uh, set fire to these houses here? No, we were just off to the left of it when it was burning. Were you getting fire from them? Somewhat, not too much. Just a little sniper fire. It first appeared that the Marines had been sniped at and that a few houses were made to pay. Shortly after, an officer told me he had orders to go in and level the string of hamlets that surrounds Camney Village. And all around the common paddy field that feeds these hamlets, a ring of fire. 150 homes were leveled in retaliation for a burst of gunfire. In Vietnam, like everywhere else in Asia, property, a home, is everything. A man lives with his family on ancestral land. His parents are buried nearby. Their spirit is part of his holding. If there were Viet Cong in the hamlets, they were long gone. Alerted by the roar of the amphibious tractors and the heavy barrage of rocket fire laid down before the troops moved in. The women and the old men who remained will never forget that August afternoon. The day's operation burned down 150 houses, wounded three women, killed one baby, wounded one Marine, and netted these four prisoners, four old men who could not answer questions put to them in English, four old men who had no idea what an ID card was. Today's operation is the frustration of Vietnam in miniature. There is little doubt that American firepower can win a military victory here. But to a Vietnamese peasant whose home is a, means a lifetime of backbreaking labor, it will take more than presidential promises to convince him that we are on his side. Morley Safer, CBS News, near the village of Cam Nhi.